All right, guys, now it's time to respond to your request. Now, generally, we would think that the request handler is going to have some response data and then we pass it on to the router module and then we pass it on to the server module where the server is finally going to respond to the request. Well, no, instead, we are going to take this response object, pass it from our server to our router module and then to our handler module so that the handler can respond to the request itself. So in our server.js file, include this new parameter. So, sorry, include in the route function, this new parameter, which is going to be the response object. And we are going to be removing these three lines of response code because the server is not going to respond with anything. Now, since we have changed the route function, let's go to our router module and pass this new response object. And if we have a handler for a URL, then we need a response object. And if we don't have an if we don't have a handler, then we're going to say response dot right head. And the status is going to be 404. So 404 and then content type is going to be text slash plain then response dot write we're going to say error 404 page not found and finally let's end the response now save it and we need to finally change our handler code now if you remember the original requirement, it said that when the user visits the home page, then he should be having a review form where the user can type in a review and then click on the submit button. So I have already a HTML, fi HTML file. So instead of having to type it out all over again, let me just copy and paste it. So in our home handler create a new variable HTML file and this is equal to the content so let me just quickly go through what this HTML file is now nothing in the head tag that body we are going to be including a new form now when the user clicks on the submit button it's going to take them to the URL slash review and we are going to have a text area provided to them and this text area is where they're going to write the review and then we have a submit button that is going to take them to the review URL. So simple enough. Now in our home function, let's pass the response object and then we are going to say response.writehead that the status was okay, so 200. Then the content type is going to be so content type is going to be this time text slash HTML. So text slash HTML. And then let's write out this response dot write this HTML file. And then let's end the response. So response dot end. Now we can have this HTML code in a separate file, but I wanted to keep it simple and I have included it in the handler file. So handler.js is going to be saved. Save app.js, save server.js, save router.js, save handler.js. Now when you run node app.js, we understand the server. When we refresh our home page, we get a text box. So we say request received for home, routing a request for home, and then we are executing the home handler. Now, if I type a review, this is a review. Click on submit text. Now, if you go back to your browser, it says request received for the review URL or the path, and routing a request for a review path, and then executing the review handler. Now, in a review handler, we are not doing anything right now. So, in the next video, 
let us find let us build the final part of our application and display the sub uh, display the review that the user submitted from our home page so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video and don't don't forget to subscribe bye bye